Hi gamers, I'm Cyber Settler, and today we're playing Space Engineers. So I was building my base and I was wondering which was the cheapest uh, material or, or what was the cheapest block to use, uh, the, the, the block that wouldn't require so much iron and at the same time would provide um, some protection and also um, to be airtight. So this is uh, always uh, uh, an issue, uh, and well, for me, I, if the if the base is, is is big, then you you realize that you want to build your base with the less material possible. And I uh, made uh, some research to see which was uh, the cheapest block of them, and here um, I have some. Um, data collected and for example for the light armor block uh, you can see here that the mass is 500 kilograms uh, components are steel plates only and it requires 25 um, steel plates each steel plates will consume uh, 21 iron ingots so that brings uh, to a total of uh, 525 iron ingots to build uh, one um, one light armor block that is fully constructed of course because if you only leave like the the the, the structure like um, this only this framework then you uh, it only consumes one but if we want like uh, the base to be airtight then and has some protection then um, this is what you need right so next is the half armor block and this one has a mass of 240 and it requires 12 steel plates so it's, it's less than um, half of the full block it requires uh, a total of 252 uh, iron ingots next is the, um, um, the interior wall this one requires 105 55 uh, kilogram this is uh, 155 kilograms in mass and it requires interior plate and um, construction components 25 interior plates each interior plate will take 23 ingots per plate and uh, we have um, that the construction components will take 8 ingots per component and that brings the total to 155 iron ingots so you can see here clearly that the that the winner is the interior plate by far so it's even cheaper than the uh, armor that the half armor block so this was uh, somehow surprising to me I was uh, uh, I thought that the half armor block will take less iron than the um, interior wall and one thing that you you already notice it in the in the mass right the mass is 155 uh, for the interior wall and uh, for the half armor block is 240 also you can see that um, the interior plate take, takes uh, much less material than the than the steel plate each steel plate will require 21 ingots while the interior plate will will take three and the construction component is also not that expensive it's eight uh, ingots per component and for comparison I have also the data here for the um, steel catwalk plate uh, its mass is uh, 193 kilograms um, and it requires uh, 23 interior plates seven construction components and 17 small steel tubes each one of these uh, steel tubes will take five ingots and this brings it to a total of 210 iron ingots so you can see here that 210 is still um, more expensive than the interior wall and this was also surprising to me um, because um, I would have guessed that the, that the plate that the steel cut wall plate would be cheaper than the interior wall by the way this one um, provides um, air tightness um, but you see here that um, 
Yeah, even even though that it's it's um, it's it's less than the half um, armor block is still more expensive than the interior um, wall, and the graded catwalk has a mass of 232 uh, components, 60 construction components, four girders that take six ingots per girder, and small steel and 20 small steel uh, tubes that brings it to a total of 252 iron ingots and this is very surprising because you see here that the graded catwalk requires the same uh, iron as the full armor block you see 525 and ah sorry 225 sorry sorry it's it's uh, it's um, almost the same as the half armor block, I should say, not the full armor block. 252, and this is um, 252, is the same as the half armor block. So, even though it's um, a little bit um, less, uh, it has less mass, right? It's not that heavy, 232, and this is 240, but still... It's surprising that the that that, that the crated catwalk is the same as the 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 half armor block. So and it's not uh, airtight, by the way. So this is the lesson I took. If you want to build your base uh, uh, the cheapest way possible, use the uh, interior wall as much as you can and what i do is that usually i will place like a frame of um, uh, uh, armor blocks and then i will fill that frame with um, interior walls so that that is uh, i think the, the best um, well, this is one way, but I think that the, the, the best is to use as much as possible uh, uh, of the interior wall in your builds. Well, guys, that's uh, everything for this episode. I hope you enjoy it and hope to see you in the next one. This is Cyber Settler signing off.